What's up guys and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 and today we have a very special episode We're going to be unpacking a million coins worth of stuff along with spending our 49 stars before we do We actually have more coins to get we have two promotions to get finished here. Let's see where are they? I know we have a scientist promotion should be over here. Yep, here it is. We got the astronaut to level 10 So we'll upgrade him of course to the specialist astronaut. There you go And we also have a citron. No, no, it wasn't citron. It was um, what's it got it? It was uh, the kernel corn. So let's go and uh, upgrade the kernel corn as well All right, then here's that kernel courses is going to be an extra 40,000 coins for us in total. Now we have the specialist kernel corn, and like I said, spending over a million, now 1.1 million and 49 stars on different chests across the map. It's a very special episode today. A lot of people have been asking me to spend this moolah I've been saving up, and that's exactly what we're gonna be doing. Now I'm gonna be working my way up. My goal is only to buy two or three phenomenal character packs. I yeah, I feel like I'm gonna be doing a lot that a lot throughout the series, but I do wanna buy a lot of this other stuff though. You know. I Want a lot of more minions and customization stuff so let's get started i'm gonna buy like probably like five or six of each and see how much money we have after that so let's start with the minions booster packs let's see what we get Ooh, we get some heal flowers some pea cannons a self revive terracotta weed pea gatling cool gonna work our way up but while we're doing this i will start talking about um what some things that like when it comes to tips for gaining coins I want to make my own entire video on my personal tips for gaining coins But a lot of people were confused on how I was gaining coins so fast the game has only been out since Tuesday It is now Friday. So about three days maybe four. I don't feel like counting right now <laughs> But um a million coins in that amount of time is really fast But do note that when you start the game they immediately give you a hundred thousand coins We haven't seen mr. Freezy before all right we can open up one more of these and then um not only that but um, you get 200,000 coins for pre-ordering the game. So there's 300 coin, 300,000 coins right off the bat. Not only that, but we got 50,000 extra coins for the secret area under the flag of power, which I showed off in a previous video. So there is right there, 350,000 coins. Now you get more coins in Garden Warfare 2 than you get in Garden Warfare 1. The rate of coins you get is just much faster. We have never gotten a Mr. Electro either, but I hope that sort of clears things up. Like I said, I do want to make a video soon where we start, um, giving tips on how to get as many coins as possible but for right now we're starting to open up a new pack we got some customizations painterly flower lashes quad focals dr heels and a pea gatling let's open up more helpful fun packs let's see hmm pretty good pretty good all right we got a metal mouth porcelain vase weed heel zombie fishbone blinder <laughs> that one just looks silly the baseball that might be one of my favorites so far all right then helpful fun pack number three we'll have let's see Ooh, some cool stuff in here. We got the cannon surprise, Gatling bond, huge mushrooms, or huge shrooms. That's interesting. Is that like a Mario reference? Uh, thick and pointy. <laughs> I like that one. And Buckethead Zombie. All right, then, helpful fun pack number four. Let's see what's in this one. I guess I want to open up five of these each. I don't know if we should have enough money for that. We got the target. That looks really cool. The ice shroom, silver double X's. Cornish shutters. Ooh, I want those. I don't know though. I really like the corn aviators and then a screen door zombie. So we got one more of these we can open up and let's see what's inside. We still haven't even broke that hundred thousand. Was that a picnic picnic blanket cape? But we get a rare golden corn statue backyard item. We get a bong choy, a hide and shoot bot, crazy crazy scales, and a picnic. Oh man, I like the uh, golden corn statue, but the crazy scales look really cool. All right, let's move over to the extraordinary pack. These are fifteen thousand each. So let's see. Open up one of these right now. Ooh, okay then. Fancy stuff in here. Whoa, we got a piece to a fire captain. Uh, I really don't know what his name is, but I'm sure we'll find out soon. We get the pink partic particulizer, which is, I'm guessing for the scientist. <laughs> Future fro for the imp. Stack deck for the rose, and just uh, some consumables there. Let's open up extraordinary pack number two. And this will have, ooh, ooh some good stuff. A piece to a, uh, an ice rose or a frozen rose, whatever you want to call it. The gilded green. Uh, who is that for? I'm not sure. Um, P. Gatling, Jag <laughs> Shaggy Goat, and Hide and Shoot Bot. I like the Jaggy, I like the uh, Shaggy Goat. Those look pretty darn cool. All right, extraordinary pack number three. What'll this one have for us? 
Ooh. Okay. Oh, the money. Hold on. The green and dangerous. The mustard mouth. Salty sailor. It looks like it's a little off-centered, but okay. And then the money pee. The money pee looks really cool. Then it's after heals and a leaf shield weed. All right, let's open up extraordinary pack number four. I'm liking these extraordinary packs so far. We just broke the a million coins though, so hopefully it still is a fun time from here. Okay, then this is a new Colonel Corn, which I'm glad to see. We get Enemy Finders, Leather Skin, Funnel Face, Mr. Toasty, and Scaredy Shroom. I like the Funnel Face, the Leather Tart, that's definitely for an all-star. Yeah, Enemy Finders are okay. I don't know, I feel like they could look a little better. But all right, let's open up Extraordinary Pack number four, right? Maybe number five? <laughs> All right, losing count. Whoa. Oh, whoa. did we get another funnel face? Hold on. We got um another. This is a new all-star. We got red and white stripes. That's for the Captain Deadbeard. Silver funnel face. Oh, that's a little lazy. <laughs> Still cool nonetheless. Thick stripes. Pretty zebra-tastic. A rocket bot and a leaf shield weave, weed. All right, then. Now let's do one more of the extraordinary pack here. And we get, ooh, I like that. Colonel Corn Beard. A piece to a new soldier. This one looks really cool. Uh, Twisters which I think is also for the soldiers. Screen door zombie, vase weed, dunsophone, and a hula beard. I like the hula beard, that looks funny. All right, then let's move over to the wondrous pack of greatness. What do we have in here? Ooh. Whoa, some pretty cool stuff already. We get ourselves, ooh, a piece of a stuffy sunflower. I can't wait for that. And we also have the black mamba blaster, which is cool. The snapdragon, coffin zombie, feathered dapper cap, birdhouse distractors, and swirly shades. Oh, the swirly shades look cool. That hat is pretty cool. The birdhouse things are okay. I might try them, not sure. Alrighty, let's open up our second wondrous pack of greatness here. We're really starting to churn through these coins, so I'm not sure how much we're gonna be able to afford buying five of them from here on out, but we get two character pieces now. We get, of course, a pea shooter. This looks like the Electro P, and then the Cone Imp. I'm not sure what his name is. <laughs> the Comb Stash. That's good. The Late Night Reading, the Terrible Cook, Conehead Zombie, and Dr. Heels. Alrighty, then let's continue on with more Wondrous Packs of Greatness. Let's see, let's see. Ooh, boom. All right, whoa. Got some cool stuff here. All right, so we got another Cone Imp piece, which is cool. A Wadi Wood Blaster looks cool. That's for the scientists for sure. Future Face Wrap for the Citron, Ice Shroom, Crazy Ivan for the Soldier, Silver Jaggy, and Buckethead Zombie. We'll open up one Wondrous Pack of Greatness, and then we want to start moving on. Most of this stuff also costs 35000 so we should be able to uh, afford it. Let's see. Hmm, this will be Dr. Heels. Ooh, what else? Okay, we got a piece to a rock pea. That's sweet. All right, then Blue and Red Stripes, Food Finder, Silver Cornish Shutters. Those look better than the normal shutters. Tough bandana. <laughs> Weed Wood Shield and Dr. Heels. We get a lot of Dr. Heels. I wish we would get all the bots as well. Hmm, let's open up one more of these, right? I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry I keep losing track of it. Okay, sorry about that. My microphone stand was being evil. <laughs> all right, so we got a piece to a, uh, I forget what it's called. It's called like a, a scout soldier. Oh man, it's called, ah oh, geez, I forget. But still, it's a piece of a new soldier class. Then we have a piece of a Druid Rose. I'm really excited for that one. A Flagweed, a Super Electro for the Rose. Actually, that looks cool. The Neckbeard, Candy Braces, and the Heel Flower. All right then, we'll open up one more Wondrous Pack of Greatness just to see what's inside. And it will have, oh my. Oh, is that like a banana corn? Ooh, a piece to the, like, the Papa Corn, I think it's called. The Perpule Photon Blaster for the Scientists. A lot of Scientist skins. Commander, Command and Conquer. Ooh, he's like a, his face is like the Earth. Peel Neck, <laughs> it is like a banana. Zipping, Screen Door Zombie, and Pea Gatling. All right, cool. Let's move over to the Fertilizer Fun Pack for 35,000 as well. We should be able to afford buying five of each now. Should be fine. Ooh. All right, what do we got? We got a piece to a Fire Rose and a piece to the, uh, the Petrified Cactus. Super excited for that one. Hmm, pumped up, uh-huh. Groggy goggles, bling shade, self-revive, and weed wood shield. Let's try this one more time. We should be, a, this is number two out of five, so let's see. Hmm, okay, cool, we got a stuffy sunflower, and we got more of the popcorn. All right, porcelain vase weed, triangulo. That's subtle, but I do like it. I think that fits Citron well. The organic wisdom, I think that looks okay. I don't think that's for me. Silver Face of the Ancients looks interesting. I wonder if they still have the zebra skin tattoo for the pea shooter. Probably not. I know a lot of the customizations in Garden War for 1 did not make their way over to Garden War for 2, unfortunately. We have yet to find a super rare 
hat bow. That's what I'm waiting for. We have yet to find one. If you guys don't know, there are super rare hats that are animated, but we haven't find, found any yet. So we got our third piece, I think this is. Yep, three out of five for the stuffy sunflower, and then two out of five for the rock pea. Then we got bamboo shoot, assorted flavor spikes, water well, and swirly twirls, and then a self revive. Okay, number four. What will this be? I really want to find one of those hats, but no dice. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. We might have just found something there. We got the, oh, this is the Yeti Chomper, and then a piece to an Ice Citron, a Knitted night, Nightmare. That's a super rare hat, not a uh, ultra rare. I'm not sure if it's called ultra rare or like legendary, the ones that are animated. We're totally gonna use that one, if I can remember the Knitted Nightmare. And then we have the Wedge Sights. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Pretty kitty. <laughs> self reviving Weedwood Shield. All right then, open up one more of the Fertilizer Fun Pack and then we'll move over to the next one. We still have over 500,000 coins that we can spend on whatever we want. Alrighty then, ooh, some good mix here. We got the Popcorn, we have the Cactus, we have the Chompasaurus, Arms of the Ancients, Gold Double X's, self revive and Pumpkin Weed. I really like the Chompasaurus, that looks really cool. Alrighty then. Amazing Brains Pack. Now this is gonna be the same thing, but of course, focused a little more towards the zombie side. Whoa, <laughs> what was that? All right, we're gonna piece, another piece to the Tennis Star, which is cool, the Karate Zombie, five of them too. Bumblebee Blaster, Reinforced Face, Shooting Sleep Mask, Two Bar Topper, and Self Revive. I like this a lot, it looks super duper doopy. And then Reinforced Face, just has like a cool little detail to it. All right, then pack number two of the Amazing Brains Pack, we'll have for us, Let's find out. I'm excited to see. Ooh, okay then. We got another piece of the tennis star. I've never seen this scientist before. Whoa. Oh, he has like a porcupine gun. Whoa, that's awesome. Then we have tinted future mask, cheeky beard, atoms on my mind. <laughs> cool. Conehead zombie and brown coat zombie. I'm glad to see these two actually, just because we haven't been getting those. All right, pack number three for the amazing brains pack. What will this be? Ooh. Okay, some cool stuff right off the bat I see. Another piece to a pirate zombie that's counting dead beard. I forget what this one is called, but it definitely looks cool. Then we also have a piece to the Rhodey Z engineer. So that's two out of five there. We have the high bow. We have the face of the ancients. And then we have the coffin zombie, turtle glasses, brown coat zombie. I'm glad to see a coffin zombie along with the turtle glasses look funny. The face of the ancients is okay as well. I feel like that would fit with some of them, but not as much as other super brains. All right, pack number four, maybe three. I'm not sure. I don't know how I lose like track of it so very quickly, but let's see this now. Oh my, we get whoa. Wait, I haven't seen. We got two out of five for this guy. I I don't think I've seen this guy in battle. Maybe I have. I'm not sure. But there's another uh, Captain Deadbeard, and then we have another part of this All Star. Cool. Brown coat zombie, grass face. Brow, Bo Beardo, Magic Stars, and Self Revive. I don't really like too many of the customizations in this one. Magic Stars looks really cool, but the other ones I'm not really crazy over. Alrighty then, let's open up at least one more Amazing Brains pack, maybe after that, because we still have 400,000 coins. All right, let's see what's in here. Ooh, a lot of uh, consumables. Anyways, we get another uh, Camp Ranger, I think, Soldier. Team Retry, which is pretty good. A Camo Skin, which looks awesome. Doctor Heels, fight go or Flight Goggles, Silver Thick and Pointy, and Fun Planet. I think my favorite is this uh, beard right here. Let's open up one more for sure, though. The Amazing Brains Pack. See what we get in this one. Oh my, a lot of stuff. We got two different pacifiers. Okay, we got the Shrimp Imp, our first piece of the Shrimp Imp. Pretty cool. Back of the Net, Self Revive, Silver Baby Bond, Baby Bond, Eugene, and Doctor Heels. Oh, the Eugene. <laughs> All right, and this is an okay one. We didn't get too much of what I wanted, but let's open up the Phenomenal Character Packs. Now, I'm only gonna be opening up three of these because I like opening them up on the episode that I showcase that class. So with that being said, I don't wanna overdo it. We'll open up three of them, see what we get. If you wanna see me open up more Phenomenal Character Packs, make sure you check out the showcase series, or the showcase episodes, really, of the series. And now we got AC Perry, which is one of the two new engineers that you can get in God of Warfare 2. That's pretty cool. Let's open up yet another one here. See what we get. 
Ooh, it's gonna be, oh, the vampire sunflower. Very, very awesome. I really like this one. So we got the vampire flower. You get to play that in the beta. It was a lot of fun. And finally, we'll open up one more here. We're at 143,000 coins. We've done a great job of spending it, and we get the Zen Cactus. If there's any one of them I wanted, it was at least the Zen Cactus, the coolest looking cactus that has ever existed, and it plays really fun too. With all that, that being said, we have 143,000 coins left to spend. What should we spend them on? Maybe one of everything again? Let's open up one of everything besides the phenomenal character packs and see what we get. Ooh, we get some more consumables here, of course. What else would we be getting? We're also gonna be opening up a helpful fun pack. I still haven't gotten a legendary hat after a million coins being spent, which bums me out. We got the flavor stripes, silver painterly, stately stovepipe is pretty cool, and a boxer bot. Hmm. What about this one, though? We got the extraordinary pack. It has some stuff in it, nothing crazy, but we do get a, p a part of the, uh, or petrified, I want to call it fertilized, but it's petrified. The volatile vulture blaster, screen your zombie, heal weed, a salt can, and p patterned bandana. I thought I said panda. I was like, what? All right, wondrous pack of greatness. What will this have? Hopefully, something really great. Uh, ooh, okay then. Got some more pieces, of course, to the uh, electro P. This corn, outhouse zombie, fish eye, silver Eugene, great disguise. I love that one. Alrighty then, um, fertilizer fun pack. Let's see what's in this bad boy. Ooh. All right, some, whoa, there we go. We got a super rare chomp cannon. If you're sick of being harassed by zombies on rooftops, the chomp cannon is for you. Hakalugi in their direction with this disgustingly explosive attack. That is beautiful. I wanna try that out with the Yeti Chomper whenever we do a showcase of him. Weedwood shield, veggie frame, diamond double X's, eye bush and the self-revive. Alrighty then, moving over to the uh, Amazing Brains pack. We have 13,000 coins left to spend after this. Don't know what we should spend them on. Let's see. Ooh, there's another piece of this guy. Maybe I've seen him, I'm not sure. He looks to be a zoologist or something like that. Gray Geiger Blaster, Examinator, Sleep Mask, Gold Eugene, and a brown coat and a screen door. So we have enough to buy some more Minions Booster Packs. That's what we're gonna be doing today. But then after that, don't tune out because we'll be spending all 49 of our stars. So let's get started with this. What do we have in here? Ooh. Not too bad, not too bad. The Karate Zombies look really cool, so I'm glad to get more of those. I think that's the first time we've gotten a Group Shroom as well. And what's in here? Ooh, we got the Fume Shroom now. Mr. Electro some more. Just like, I've been constantly running out of reinforcements, so it's super awesome to see all these. And we get some Flagweed, Heal Flower, Conehead Zombie, P. Gatling. All right, we have enough to buy one more after this, and then we'll be all out of cash. A million coins spent all in about 10, 20 minutes. So that's pretty cool. All right, finally we get, ooh. More Goop Shroom, Conehead, Weedwood, and Rocket Bot. Cool stuff. So there is a million coins, but I hope you enjoyed that. And if you'd like to see me, you know, earn up another million coins and spend it again, let me know in the comment section below. But for now, let's start spending these stars. So for the uninitiated, you earn stars by doing plants and zombies quests. You usually earn about three at a time. Not only that, but what can stars be spent on? Well, you can use them to clean rubble and then replace them with, of course, um, backyard items, so statues and stuff. We're gonna be saving that for later because across the map you can actually find chests which have loads of goodies that can only be opened with stars. You can also open up different areas of the map with stars, like there is a gnome target section that you should totally co totally go see my episode on if you haven't already. But let's open up a few chests that we can find around the world and let's see what this one will have. It'll have a backyard item, the backyard orchard. We also gained a few coins there. So hopefully we get a couple thousand coins out of this. Also, I see a globe over here. I'm gonna grab that. All right, we have another one here. Now they do vary. Oh, who are you? I guess we'll find out soon, won't we? But the, it does vary in terms of how much it costs. You can see these ones just cost three, but there are some that cost five and even seven. Here we get 20,000 coins. So there we go, we're already back to earning up coins. This is a decent way to get money. It seems pretty rare to actually get a good amount of coins out of it though, so you gotta spend wisely. Alrighty, then let's keep going. Wait, another globe. I'm getting really lucky with these. Alrighty then, so here's yet another chest. This one is five, so this one's a little bit more expensive. Right on the borderline between plants and zombies, we get ourselves a bamboo planter, a common backyard item. I was hoping for a little bit more for all the coin or the, all the stars we spent there, but there are even some that cost seven. So we'll be looking around for some of the more expensive ones. There's one up there, but it might be a little difficult to actually reach it. 
but I have to find yet another globe before I do so. We are going to have like a Palooza episode eventually, I want to at the least, where we look all around the map for more globes. But for now, I don't mind picking up the one or two ones that I find. All right, let's hop up here real quick, and then we can launch across here to go and find yet another chest. This one should also cost five, I'm gonna guess. Five, all right, open this bad boy up. We get ourselves some coins, and of course, a Marble Dave Uncommon Backyard item. I love that one, I totally wanna use it. Now, I'm sure I'm not the only one here who wants me to stop with the little spending and get to the big spending. You can see this big chest right under the flag of power. This one has a seven star chest. Let's see what happens when we open this bad boy up. We get a Uncommon Classy Fountain Backyard item. Honestly, I would want to get something a little better than an uncommon for seven stars. We're only at 26 now. That's how fast these things can go. Luckily, you get new quests every other day. It's like every 48 hours. So let's see, let's open up this one right here. We got this seven star chest as well, boom. And this one has the brain tower. Hey, there's a zombie, super rare though. That actually looks really cool too. So something we'll definitely look into doing, but let's bust that guy open. And then let's see. We got a few different ones over here, so let's try to get them. Um, we have 19, though, so we'll be able to open up two more of these seven. Let's see. This one has a super rare, the Wiener Tower. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, then let's walk over here and open up this one as well. And let's see. It is a super rare, the Heavy Hitter. Very cool. We only have five stars left. So we could, if we wanted to, spend them on that big fish over there. But I'm not going to, just for you guys. I don't think we can afford any of these ones in this area anymore, so we might have to go back and find a five-star chest. I'll look around, though. All right, it looks like we have our final five-star chest right here, and this'll have, ooh, the Robo Scarecrow. Looks pretty darn cool. And there we go, all of our stars have been spent in all of our cash as well. We do have a little bit more, but I have to save that up for future occasions. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you would like to see more spending Palooza videos like this, let me know in the comment section below as we go and pick up this orb. But really though, I really do appreciate it when you guys watch the end of the videos and all that kind of cool stuff. And I really hope you enjoyed this special little video. If you guys are interested in a, you know, coin tips video on how I earned up so many coins in such a short amount of time and all that kind of cool stuff, I definitely be willing to post a tips and tricks video on that but for now thank you guys so much for watching i hope you've enjoyed today's episode if you did make sure to give this video a like share it with your friends and family and of course comment in the comment section below if you watch this point of video make sure you comment money zebra so i know you've watched the end of the video and that you're a zebra tastic viewer but either way thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you next time bye bye